Hi friends, this is Shinu and this time in Flavors of Life it's going to be a short visit vlog. Yes, I am visiting a place and it is one of the biggest attraction in that place and it is Buckingham Fountain in Chicago, the Windy City. So get geared up to travel with me. I have shared little travel experiences and small knowledge about the Buckingham Fountain. I know. So are you ready to walk with me? Yes, of course. I did a lot of walking because I prefer to do so because the loop train or the metro train we take does not take us straight away to the Buckingham Fountain. We have to walk a lot of distance but that is a part of exploring, right? So I love to do it and I often take the less traveled path. I normally don't travel through the roads. So I took this ground area where there is also a walking path beside it. We took around a 15 minutes walk in this beautiful green canopy and the walk did not end here I just took you here because you have to see these flowers they are rich vibrant and it was so eye pleasing friends the real view or the naked eye view was so much nice I don't know how far justice I have done through the camera it was so really nice and this is why I take parts like this so that you get to experience a different seen out from the hushing busing cars buses and the metros you can peacefully walk to it and there we are almost nearing the buckingham fountain and this is a pathway towards the buckingham fountain buckingham fountain has different entrances this is not just the one but we chose this because this is quite near to the millennium park and that's how we feel comfortable walking so uh, why am I showing this path is because just see how well maintained it is hats off to the people yes of course it's one of the um, uh, tourist attractions in Chicago it must be maintained but definitely look at the roads even the roads are very clean and the bushes the trees the ground itself was well maintained and as I was telling you there is also a different entrance this is the Clarence Buckingham Memorial Fountain this is named so because this was actually a donation done by Kate Buckingham in remembrance of her brother Clarence Buckingham and later the fountain was named as Clarence Buckingham Memorial Fountain itself this is one of the largest fountain in the world and we should not miss this right so I am seeing it and I'm definitely taking you also along with it can you see the water out there okay we are just nearing it and there are small fountains as we go through the way we are walking towards it as you can see my camera keeps shaking because I'm not uh, an expert in vlogging I'm just learning and I really wanted to share my experience and of course a visual treat too Okay, let me just climb the stairs so that I can give you a shakeless view, a proper view of the fountain. So there I am, I climbed the stairs and as you can see there is some piece of artwork which I didn't find very interesting but there is uh, some piece of artwork down there. I'm not a kind of person who can interpret artwork so I kept on walking. Can you see a distance view of the Buckingham fountain? It's so grand friends, I don't know if you can see through the video, it was so grand. As soon as I stepped onto the floor, it was so chill, the breeze was so cold because there's a lot of tons and tons of water in the Buckingham Fountain itself. As you can see from a distance itself, the Buckingham Fountain takes the shape of a cake. Actually, it's like a wedding cake. Okay, let us go a little more nearby so that we can get a good view of it. So we are almost near it. From this point, we can't go inside because there is a fencing. So this is a distant view. It's so grand as I already told. It's a feast for your eyes itself. And there's a lot of small sculptures inside the fountain which symbolizes certain other elements of the city. And you can see there's a lot of water piping out in and out of this. And there is, they told me there are little shows out here. And evening there will be a lot of lights. So we can't wait till the evening. So let's see what show they have to give us. And I will be filming that too. So let's see what treat do we have by the time little nap time for my baby as you can see this was a show they told us we were lucky enough to get it as soon as we came in 
the water was literally piping out at 150 feet high friends you cannot even stand near it because it was making you making you and your face and your dress totally wet i loved it i was like filming it from a distance because i went near it and i got water all over my phone so i came back to a distance to film that extravagant view i will tell you it was so nice and of course my daughter was not at all bothered about it she was playing not much in the buckingham fountain we just strolled out of it and we planned to go to the lake which was just opposite to the buckingham fountain and yes definitely i took a different path as you can see it looks like a forest but it is not a forest it's in the center of the city but look at it the trees are so big it's well maintained and it is old look at that lantern lamps i was so crazy of it from the movie narnia these kind of lamps has always been my craze after i watched that movie called narnia where there is lamps snow and a lot of different people in around that movie as you can see the camera was getting darker because the trees actually covered all the sky and lights from me and we are going to cross the road and go to the lake there you're going to get a beautiful view there too so let me take you there until i cross and i reached there almost it is little dangerous to take the kids out here because you don't have a proper fencing but i made sure i was so careful with her i never let her down she was in the stroll or if i let her down for five to ten minutes i was behind her itself just like a hawk who would watch the prey so as you can see i am filming with my daughter in my hand so definitely it's going to be a little shaky it actually looks like a sea for me people call it a lake i'm not from a place where there's a lot of water bodies so i love seeing water i love to sit down and enjoy but you know with a baby it's not not at all possible as you can see the beautiful blue waters and a lot of ships were rushing not ships actually boats speed boats were going um to and fro there were a lot of rides here and uh, this is a provision to sit actually it looks a little dangerous with a baby without a baby i would definitely sit there and watch the water and there were little fishes coming there people were feeding it and there were ducks swans and all which i didn't film but people told it they used to come there when you start feeding so that's all about the lake it was so beautiful i don't want to bore you by showing it again and again yes of course playtime i was so conscious she was running towards the area which is dangerous so i was running behind with her and this is a very long view as of course you can see a lot of buildings and time for me to rest because my husband is taking care of my daughter sit down take rest you know so yeah sitting down watching the lake from here oh yeah they come she started screaming he didn't have another go he has to come there were a lot of music so dance time yeah it was all okay after the fun as you can see this is how the buckingham fountain looks from the lake side it's just a road cross to the either viewpoints so that's all for today this is this was a short visit to the buckingham fountain and the lakeside as you can see we are heading back home because it was almost evening and nap time for my baby so bye bye lake bye bye buckingham fountain so that's all for today and of course little snaps as a daughter she feeds each and everything to her father so now she's trying to feed a leaf whatever daughter gives definitely a father's going to eat so he is trying to eat it and make her happy yes of course to all the fathers out there belated happy father's day the sacrifices and hard work you do is always worth it so thank you for watching consider subscribing stay healthy stay happy bye bye